Well done, Arthur. You found the Irish Terrier. Sadly. He's just a younger version of you. Please don't say that to me, Dutch. <laughs> oh, it's true. It's true. Hey. Mr. Morgan? Damn, I've been speaking to myself all day. See this shit? Damn. Uh, my fault, guys. Uh, I just started this shit. All right, food pro. Yeah, we gotta fuck with the food product here. So, purchase that up. Boom, completely. So I'm sorry, guys. I had to uh, pause the game and then make it all the way to the camp so uh so we don't have to sit here and waste time you looking at the video you know look at that rabbit licking his arm while he hanging look at oh no he did all right food everything is finished all right we got medicine we got armor we got food say no more we got this here hold on Let's look at the food. What she got? Something to take. Sweet. I could take some food here. Some food to take. You already know. It's pretty well. Medic. Medicine. Alright, fuck it. I'm not gonna waste my time. We're gonna go see John Marston. What's up, Biatch? Thank you. All right, so um, we're gonna go rob that train. This boy wants a little bit of money. John. Damn, you ugly good. as shit. You? Yeah, fucked Got up. Everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles. I'll go get him. Meet uh -huh. us at the wagon when you can. Sure. See you, Arthur. Ain't that dumb. Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. Yep. <sighs> Alright, I'll unlock some good missions here. Let's see what we got here. Let's go to, uh, here. Soon, yeah. Okay. Hello. Hi. 
Oh, boy. Hey. Hello! I got no idea. Hey, dumb as shit, man. Who's this, uh? Hi, Arthur. Come here a minute. What is it? <sighs> Can I ask you a favor? Probably what is it, not. my bitch? Very funny. Would you do something with Jack? No. He seems kind of down. All this upheaval can't have been easy on the poor kid. Why? Because I'm your preferred nursemaid? Because he likes you, and, well, you know his father's useless. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Damn, she's saying. Alright, where's this young bull? I'm gonna sit here and take care of him. You know, he a little kid. And when he's old, oh my god, boy, I'll sit here, help this father, you know, in Red Dead Redemption, he killed, um, how you call this, John Marston died, and what I did was, got his revenge. Playing. Anything fun? I guess. You wanna come fishing with me? Fishing? Sure. <laughs> it's about fishing. Time that you started to earn your cape. Okay. Good. Let's go get your pole then. Now, you do have a fishing pole, don't you? I sure do. Uncle Jose made me one. Good. Well, let's go get it then. Go catch us some fish. <laughs> yeah. I'll mount up and lift you on when you're ready. Okay, bet. So, where are we going? Just down to the river near here. We shouldn't go too far from camp. Oh, okay. You feeling better? I know you was a little sick. Oh, I'm fine. You're a brave kid. So, just like you. Well, I don't know about brave. Sound like a girl talking, but much for kidding I'll woman. take it. Well, your mama might disagree. There are a few other women, I guess. What do you mean? Uh, I'm just talking um. silly. <laughs> Been a tough few weeks up in that snow. I like the snow. Yes, but not like that. This kid. Why are we going back to the other camp? The one near Blackwater? Yeah. Well, uh oh. We're not. This is our spot. For now, anyway. Oh, snap. I forgot a storybook there. We left so quick. Sure, someone can get you another storybook. All right, this looks as good a spot as any. All right, we're gonna sit them down, I guess. We're gonna teach them how to fish, man. Where should we stand, Uncle Arthur? Down by the shore. Come on, follow me. That's one thing. I, they did not talk about Arthur. You show me where, Uncle Arthur. All right. Just by the water there? You mean? First, we need some bait. Oh, shit. I'm gonna use some cheese. Cheese? The bellier the better. Now, cast your line. Swing the rod back over your shoulder. And bring it forward Neat. in a smooth motion. Use your wrist, not your elbow. Are you bored of fishing already? Yes, that bitch out. Like that? Yes, my yeah, dude. Good. All we do now, Jack, is wait for a fish to take the bait. How do I know when I've got a bite? 
Well, if you feel the tip of your fishing rod just twitching, don't yank it yet. That just means one's nibbling. Uh huh. If you feel a hard tug, that's a fish going for the bait. So yank hard to hook it. Something's tugging at your rod, Uncle Arthur. There, got him. Pull him in. Oh shit. Neat. You see him fighting there, Jack? That's when you gotta be careful. You, you'll break the line. Best to wear him out. Ooh, first I got a fish. You try to reel him in. Look, Jack, it's a bluegill. It's almost as small as you. We should really throw these smaller ones back. Give them a chance to grow up a bit. That's cool. Can I take a break from fishing? I want to make something. Okay. Okay, that put the cheese. I'm gonna pick some of those red flowers. I'll be right back. I like the look of that spot. All right. I hope I get a big fish, man. I want. I'm hungry. Should neat. Eat that shit up. Come on, bitch. <laughs> you that ass, boy. Well, seems like he's taking a rest now. I'm gonna try reeling him in, nice and steady. Oh man, this shit. A little fat. Mm. That bitch fat. Shit thick. Mm. This one's a smallmouth bass. Not bad. Should I keep it? Hold on, let's see. I like 50%. Fuck, 50%. Uh, fuck it, I'm keeping that bitch. Fishing sure is boring, Uncle Arthur. Yeah, I know. Boring as hell. But then. Something happens. Mm -hmm. You can get food for days. Really? Yep. If you're lucky. But until then, you just sit, wait, try not to worry. It's good for you. It's good for you? I guess. Huh. It always is good for you, man. Sit down, wait, look at the sky. It, Jack. I know. You've got a bite, Uncle Arthur. Fish on the line. I see. I see. I hope he's big, man. Not that little shit. Oh my god. Alright, let's see. This. What? This necklace I made. Necklace? For Mama. Sure. What a fine young man. And in such oh, complex fuck. circumstances. Arthur, isn't it? Arthur Morgan? Who are you? Yes. Arthur Morgan. Vanderlyn's most uh -oh. trusted associate. You've read the files. Typical case. Mm -hmm. Orphan street kids seduced by that maniac silver tongue and matures into a degenerate murderer. Agent Milton, mm -hmm. Agent Ross, Pinkerton Detective Agency, seconded to the United States government. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. Uh huh. Five thousand dollars for your head alone. Damn. Five thousand dollars for me. Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. Old Dutch. I haven't seen him for months. That's so. Because I heard guy fitting oh his my description God, that forehead clean. Belonging to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Mm. Oh, ain't that a little old-fashioned nowadays? Apparently not. Listen. 
This is my offer, Mr. Morgan. Bring in Vanderlyn, and you have my word you won't swing. Oh, I ain't gonna swing anyways, Agent uh, Milton. No. You see, I haven't done anything wrong, aside from not play the games to your rules. Mm -hmm. Spare me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Callender. Mac Callender? He was pretty shot up by the time I got to him. So really, it was more of a mercy killing. Slow, but merciful. <laughs> You enjoy being a rich man's toy, do you? I enjoy society, flaws and all. You people venerate savagery, and you will die. Savagely, all of you. Oh, we're all gonna die. Bitch, Agent. I will oh, kill us. you, Agent. Don't play with me, bro. Game, I will boy. give you this Goodbye. bullet in your ass cheek, man. Kid. Why you still can. <laughs> That's why he killed you, Ross. <laughs> no one to worry about, no one at all. Uh-oh. Let's pick up your things and get home. <laughs> it's getting late, Jack. Remind All right, me, now. Let's head back. Okay, boy. Alright, now, this is one problem. Ross is already dead That Miller, I don't know what happened to him. Yeah. But... Why did you lie about where Uncle Dutch is? Because, because we're in a situation. Because those are disagreeable men. And I don't want them to hurt him. What did mm -hmm. they mean about Matt? Is he in jail? Nah, he did. No, I don't uh, think so. He's not fine. I hope he's just fine where he is. Like I said, don't worry about them. The world is full of disagreeable men. Uh huh. That's why you got all of us to protect you from folk like them. Now, how about that necklace you made? You still got it, right? Yep. Yeah, I got it. Good. Did you like fishing? It was okay. okay. I think it's a lot of waiting around. It is. All right. Boys get known. Great. We caught a fish and I made you this necklace. Ain't that pretty? Not the luckiest. Did you thank Uncle Arthur? No need. We had a good time. Mm, good time. A very yeah. great time. Nothing. Just met some folk. I better go speak with Dutch. Okay. Hey. You did real fine, kid. Thanks. <sighs> All right. Mr. Duck. We got a problem. What? I just met some guys out near the river. A fella mm -hmm. named, um, Milton and, uh, I don't remember the other fella's name. Ross. Milton and Ross. And, and they are employees of the Pinkerton Detective Agency. And they know about the train and they know we're here. Well, you followed back here. No. They know we're near here. And they want you, Dutch. They offered me my freedom in exchange, they did. Why didn't you take it? <laughs> Very funny. Well, what do we do now? I say we do nothing just yet. It's just trying to scare us into doing something stupid. We have turned a corner. We survived them mountains. We just need to stay calm. He about to, he about to set up some plans. Now situations about to go down. Fishing man. All right, let's see. So I finish with a uh, Jack and everything. You know, my next mission will be here. I'm going to see Matthews. John Marston is right there. I gotta see the shorty, so you know what? Fuck it. Mac Bell. He's next. Guys, just um I'ma cut this so 
basically I'm gonna cut it. So you're gonna I'm gonna get on my horse. Where's my horse at? My horse is right there. Once I get on this horse, I'm just gonna run a little bit and then I'm just gonna cut the I'm just gonna cut this part to getting down there because it's gonna take too long and I know y'all don't wanna just watch um me ride all the way down there. Just Alright guys, we're just close to Bell. Right now we're pulling up to him. Just like a little bit closer now. You know, gotta go up to these hills. Alright, let's go. Now I gotta speak to this bull. This bull gotta speak to him. What the hell yeah? Okay, he's down there, so I'm gonna go. See if I can run. Damn, I can't run. There we go. You better go. Who goes there? Hey, Arthur. Good to see you. Why? You want mm. rescuing again, do you? <laughs> no. I got a plan to make it up to you. All right, what's the plan? Like the Blackwater ferry job? Or uh huh. Like you going off scouting and ending up in jail? Mm -hmm. Dutch said you was a, a big shadow cast by a tiny tree. I don't even know what that means. Mm, I thought you was a tough boy. <laughs> Not one of those gentlemen trying to protect his riding clothes. I just know whenever things get real, you turn yellow and lose your head. Yellow? Sure seems that way. So I guess you won't be riding with me to rob the banking coach comes about this time in the strawberry. I heard one of the O'Driscoll boys yapping about it while I was inside. You and me? Do a robbery? That's what I said, didn't I? After you. <laughs> There's a spot up this way. Now we talking. They said we're gonna rob a bank in this game. Sweet. Ladies first, man. What are you doing anyway, camping out here like some crazy hermit? Can't exactly stay in town now, can I? Uh -huh. Like I told you, I ain't going back to Dutch without a peace offering. Uh -huh. So what's the deal with this coach? What do you mean? Comes through about this time every day, like I said, the end. I mean, how many men, guns, riders? Nothing serious. It'll be fine. I heard the bank's been hiring every trigger man they can get of late. The meaner, the better. Forgive me if I ain't wholly faithful to right something now. Driscoll told you when you was half drunk in a jail cell. What the fuck is that? A beaver? About it, saying how they've been hitting it on the regular. That's a good lead yep, in this my is a beaver, dog. Damn old Driscolls are everywhere now. Probably not on the back of most big oh, valley. What is it? Heard they took over some big ranch north of here. Alright. How the hell you and Lenny end up down here anyway? Oh, you know how it is? A few loose ends. Drink mm -hmm. here, drink there. What loose ends? Nothing that needs to concern you. I always pay my share. It concerns me when you put us in danger and we don't realize till it's too late. Like that move you pulled at Strawberry. Making me kill half the town just for your precious guns. Precious they are. You need to roll a little looser, Morgan. Looser? I seen you come full undone more than once now, and you only been running with us a few months. Are we gonna rob this coach or bicker about it? What's done is done. Guess we're robbing it. Then let's do it. Or is it me or you just taking too long? Because this is a long trip we are going to so um, I'm just getting tired of it you know let me just hurry up and run faster cuz I don't have time all right this is the spot all right, about time hold up on this ridge why am my horse going slow man what the hell oh. move up there we go they should be here in a little bit. Mm -hmm. Old tide. 
Which way will they be coming in? Should be from over there. We need to hit them fast before they get into town. Just right. don't lose your head this time. Of course, tough guy. Oof. They should be here any minute. Any bro, he in said any minute. Right on time. Get covered up. Come on! <laughs> it was like night time now it's became morning. Attack the guards and stop. Right now! What in the covered now it's just you and me sweetheart yeah all right i thought he's gonna take me out i'll give it to them they put up half a fight at least yeah they luck come on boy all right mm. just rub this to my left to have a new ride too here you go arthur from me to you that's more your Style than mine. Got a what clip and everything. Like licking butter off a knife. Something like that. You don't want to just put it open here and be done with it. Could be more than we can carry. And there might be a second crew of riders tailing. All right, then. Not to mention. We ride back in with a big take and a new wagon to boot. Dutch can't say we ain't pulling our weight no more, can he? I ain't sure I trust this new act of yours one bit. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know we got off on the wrong foot, but I got no beef with you. I reckon we're a lot alike, you and me. Now, hold up there. Dutch knows I'm a feller that gets things done, same as you. Things done. You'd be wearing a California collar now if I hadn't broken you out of jail. And I have expressed my gratitude, have I not? It's done. Main thing now is getting this haul back in one piece. Have did I just move to chapter two? Because like to keep it a beam, it says chapter one. I didn't. I don't know. Cause this game seems like it's long. I know how that is gonna be, man. I hate. Oh. Shit! Now we're being run. Get across the river! Oh, Shoot him! What the hell? Oh, y'all asses about to get hit. Oof. Ooh, I like this rifle. Damn. That's just gas right there. Oof. Almost had you. Oof. Oh, 
my god. We should really pick up a lock breaker one of these days. Mm -hmm. Save ourselves some bullets. Yeah, because saving bullets is such a concern of yours. Let's take what we can and get the hell out of here. That lock should shoot off easy enough. I'll give you the honors. On account of, well, this little mess. Come on, I'm happy. You are happy Doing for myself. what? Where's the lock? That's my question. Go on then. I can't find the lock. That's my question. You shoot I'm done wasting my breath on you. <clears throat> oh, he that should do it. Come on, let's see if all this was worth. All I see is you, me, a river full of dead O'Driscolls. And a lockbox. Hmm. I'd say we're golden here, Morgan. Look at Okay, that. paper. What's the cut here? It's good. Just make sure the gang gets its piece. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, big shadow, tiny tree. Mm. And like I said, that still don't mean big nothing. Big shadow, tiny tree. Dutch. Make Just sure fun. you ain't followed. I know, boss. I know. It's been fun. Damn, $300. Your boy paid in cash. Fuck that. I'm not paying. I'm telling you, I'm not paying my, um, my fucking bounty. You got me chopped. Mm -mm. Keeping $300. Mm -mm. I'm at least, I'm gonna, you know what? I feel a little, no, I feel a little honest that I'm gonna give away, uh, at least $100 to my, uh, to the camp, you know, huh? Cause I feel feel loyal to my for my squad. All right, like I'm gonna say it again, guys. Um, I'm gonna cut this again, so please don't go. I'm gonna grab my hat first. Hold on. Grab my mask on, neat, and I'm gonna keep going. What the hell you playing at? All right, just moments away, guys. With uh, John Marston. Alright, who's this? Oh, shit. <coughs> ah, well, at least it ain't the your job. Ah, shut up, Arthur. Yeah, your job's starting the fights. You ain't winning them. Fucking scrap, Arthur. I'm just not good at homework. I can see. Besides. What do you care, Englishman? You've got no time for me. I tried to find your work, but then you're off cutting jobs with other folks, and your boy doesn't get a look in. Guess I don't okay. want to get shot, that's all. Yeah, you're a real fucking funny shit, Arthur Morgan, huh? Real fucking funny. Calm real down. fucking you funny. You better sleep with your eyes open. Yeah, well, you're going to sleep with your chest open if you ain't careful, boy. <laughs> oh, shit. I love you, Arthur Morgan. I love you. Come on, take a shot. Come on, take your best shot, please, eh? Oh, oh shit. And let me come on the raid, witches. Raid? Don't be playing coy with me, son. It's unbecoming. Mm -hmm. That bloody train you and him has set up. What you're doing out here, you're going to need guns. You're going to need men. Oh, that. Mm -hmm. So Marston told you? It ain't a big show. I need calmness. If I take you, I might as well bring Micah along. Now compare me to that oily toward again. You're a dead man. <laughs> Fair enough. <sighs> anyway, Arthur, what's your problem with me? In fact, don't tell You don't know how to shoot. I already know. That's my problem. I don't know about his problem, but that's, that's my problem. Youthful vigor. Go around the shot. Does it? It's a story as old as the hills. The changing of the guards, the fading of the light, 
You're mm. old stole man. Okay. You call me old. Who are you? I'm the future. In all its glory. Yeah, well, all his up. glory. Good luck and shut up. <laughs> I want to get some rest before nightfall. All right. That's when John Morrison comes. Wake up, you lazy sap. What are you doing here, kid? I'm coming, John. On the job. I said you weren't coming. Yeah, well, Arthur says I am. And it's his party, boy, so come on, let's go. <laughs> Me and the big uh -oh. cheeses. Love it. Can't wait to slit some bastard's throat. You sure about this? No. <laughs> are we ready? Yeah. Train's due through tonight. All right, then. Mm. It's on. Charles? I'm ready. Damn, Damn, Charles. Let's go earn some money. Hold up. Is he dark skinned? Because I never saw a dark skinned man hey, with long hair like that. I'm tether? sorry. No they disrespectful. Show. Good. Fall but I never them. saw that shit. If I see that shit, that would be like, yo. Ah. <laughs> hold, wait, hold up. My fault. I was just saying, because like, if I see a black man with long hair like that straight, oh my god. I'm like, yo, I like your hair and everything. But you need to cut that shit off, bro. I won't even have long hair like that. I'll tell myself to cut that shit off. For a couple of weeks, and you cut me out of all the action. Just the action that requires a break. Ah, you're a funny fella, John Marston. From my folks, eh? You had your feet up the whole time, playing sick. I can't and deal with that, that long, you long hair. Mm -hmm. in the morning. You don't know she what you're talking hair. about. Stay close on this. Wouldn't want you getting scratched by a squirrel or something. That could put you out of commission right, for the rest of the year. Do Why do you have to speak so much? Oh, fuck this, guys. I'm gonna just skip this. They're left here, towards roads. Slow down a bit. Plus, I've still got some blood in me veins. You old bastards have forgotten how to live. I blame you two for rescuing them. Far too much trouble for what we got out of it. Yeah, takes a whole army of bounty hunters to bring in Sean McGuire. And look at me now. In the gutter sea. <laughs> Back in business, boys. Mm. You know, my dad always used to say... Not the dad, no, please. Not this oh. again. Fine. Damn you three. Sulky, angry... Face. A right barrel of laughs. <coughs> so, we got the tracks with the wagon then jumping. That's the plan. Pretty much. Charles, you deal with the engineer. John, secure the passenger car fast. Take charitable donations and make sure everyone behaves. Slow down. Here's good. Stop the wagon. He's Irish. Irish men talk funny to me. We handle this right. Hey, Nobody needs to die here. Yeah, yeah. Let's get it on. <laughs> Irish men are funny when they talk. Yeah. Mr. Marston. Mr. Smith. Mr. McGuire. Yeah. Smack that ass. Get over there. When she slows, order. And you? I'm gonna make sure she slows. Mm -hmm. I'll still a die with you. <laughs> I like it. Get moving. Oh, Here shit. Yeah, the, Ir the Irish man, man. Oh, he got. Oh, I thought he was black. African American, but I don't know. Oh, shit. What's going on here? What's going on? Ah! Ah! Nothing good. Is he? I don't know if he is African American or black. I'm well, going black and African-American is the same thing, there. but All right, get on that train. gotta see. Hey. I can't even see his face. Faster. The oh, only black person I saw was Lenny. Oh, 
Oh, funny. We got drunk together. Well, like he never drunk before, but. All right, peeps. Get shot. Go. Everything you got. Money, valuable. There you go. Let's make this quick, people. Come on. We ain't leaving till this bag's full. Just put the gun down. I beg of you. I beg of you. You want to have a little chat with Romeo and Juliet here? What's the problem? Money, ah. hey. Don't do this. Just give it to him, Thomas, please. Get robbed, Mr. Okay. Okay. Everything you got, bag, God damn it. Got. Keep it coming. Don't be shy. People like you make me sick. These two seem to think we're sick. Hey. You're not even sick. You're healthy. I'll do anything. You d pause. You do anything. Give me that shit. Give me that money. We'll go down. Watch. Let's see what you got. You got, Mister. You won't get hurt. Just for your money. Nothing else. Make me hurt you. Mm -hmm. I know you're not a bad, not a bad man. You're just a rich man. I'm a poor man. Come on. Thank you. First of all. First of all, I will kill you because you got some nasty ass beard, sideburns. That shit look ugly. I'm sorry, that shit gotta go. You go ahead and look for the baggage car. Let's go. Pay up. Empty your pockets, mister. You can be on your way. Let me hand you over to my friend then. Damn. We're on the clock. I'm making money. Come on, cuff it up, people. Don't be shy. Everything you got. Let's go. All your money. Come on. Got a big problem. A dollar and forty. I'll take that. I don't care. Bro, your sideburns. It's nasty. Cut that shit off. Oh, they knocked that motherfucker out. We're on the clock here. All right, you got nothing. Okay. Okay. None of you folks move a muscle. You're getting robbed. You hear, Mister? Get everything you got. What is? You all right? Fill the baggage car. For Christ's sake! You ain't even taking a look yet. I I didn't finish. Something in here, Arthur. Oh, shit. Shot right in the leg. Uh, fuck's sake. Ah! For fuck's sake. Uh, I'm sorry. Ah, come on, get off me, little Irish. Get up. <sighs> Gotta kill people. I'll look and you Just the fucking. Save your ass. I'm seeing double here. That gives you twice the chance of hitting someone. <laughs> Very funny. These folks are rich, all right. Oh my God, I'm getting money, 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 money. Keep your eyes peeled. Give me that shit, boy. Oh. I know, that's what's worrying me. Ooh. Take that. Me take me see. Right. Me like. No the hell I'm not going nowhere. I don't even care whoever comes. Come on, we should get out of here. Shut up, bro. I'm not finished. Hold up, pause. Did I just saw what I just like? Thank you. Bro, we not going Arthur, out. we've got a problem. There's two assholes on horses. How many you say? I just see a pair of them. Uh, in that case, we're fighting. Horse, Schmidt, get ready. You men come out the train now, do you hear? Let's see. We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Mm -hmm. I'll do you right away. That way neither you get killed. Goddamn liberties. Eh? There's a few more of them turning up. 
Oh shit. shit. Okay. Let's deal with them. Money, 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 money. Get that ass, boy. We got more room from the trees there. The law says so. The law says so. Rob all of them. Oof. Oh shit. Oof. Good man, this guy right in front of you, bro. Oof. Charles. Let's see, Charles. Sounds like a normal game. Boy, he's probably Indian. I don't know. Never know. Indian. Hold up, Morgan. We gotta go. Escape the law, dead or alive. Right, let's lose him. All right. Go go. Bro, how much I got? Three hundred forty-one dollars and sixty-six cents. Total of the robbery was two something. And if they give me a cut, I'm gonna be happy because I'll give some money to the camp. You know, a hundred dollars away. Keep some of my money. Fun boys, real fun. We can see what they call you the professionals in the outfit. Shut <laughs> up. At least we made some money. Hey, what did I get? Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? Oh, we shit. still need a real big tank. Enough for us to get out of here. Was that a setup? Law turned up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so, but I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Maybe. They found me already near Horseshoe, but I think this law was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine, see if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way, we should all go it alone right now. You know the First of all, cut all y'all hair, of man. Not, boss. I need to cut y'all hair. Get a nice, fresh cut. I'm growing my beard back. I need a cut. Alright, man. I guess... Let's see, let's see, let's see. I made enough money right now. I want it dead. Oh, $70. Now I got one more mission. So, uh, Matthews. So, guys, just stay tuned. I'm gonna cut it off again. I'll be right back. Alright, now we're here at Matthews to finish this mission. Yeah, mission. Yeah. See no more. It's an interesting way of putting it, Seamus. Uh, no doubt. I do interesting very well. Oh, it's oh, trusting shit. I don't do so well. Oh, please. Partner, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no Seamus. such thing. Respective new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't mm -hmm. want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Mm -hmm. Let us prove ourselves. Prove ourselves to this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. Mm -hmm. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not 
idiots. Let us prove it to you. All right, okay. what you got? I'll tell you what. Cut. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now, you go get that, and then we can work together. All right. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you mm -hmm. want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. By mm -hmm. marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. <sighs> There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine okay. with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. He he Let's go rob his cousin. Oh, he gonna rob his cousin. <laughs> All right. Matthews, you do what? I follow you, I guess. So, really? really, look out, Arthur. Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me. All right. You're the one who's been out gallivanting around here. That's that what you call it. Well, clearly, you've recovered from your bear encounter. All right. Could have played that better, couldn't you? Thought you wanted me here to show some strong. So That's we're gonna get some more goes. money. Yes, but so right now I got like damn five hundred and twenty nine dollars and fifteen cents. Damn, that shit thick. You won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches. That's easy money. Tell that nigga to suck my balls. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus's old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats thing. now. So what's the story with that emerald ranch? You find out anything else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all accounts. Seamus is sure scared of him. That's not saying much. Something strange about the place. Used to be a saloon there, general store. Now it's all closed up, but they seem to have money. Sounds worth a look around. For sure. Seamus also mentioned the rancher's daughter a couple of times. Okay. How he used to see her around all the time, but now she never leaves the house. Probably just sweet on her. That what you call finding out a little? Ooh. Once he opens up, seems Seamus does like to talk. Hopefully not too much. All right, let's see. Easy. That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. All right, we're gonna rob his cousin. Let's see what we're dealing with. Get this going done. Stop walking like that, bro. We really. <sighs> There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. All right, let's see what I could do. Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. Let's see. Item, item. There we go. Anyone around? Yes. There you okay. Tell. I reckon we can do it now. I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little show while you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Night sounds fine. Just wait. Well, gonna Dutch. Okay, let's go. Sure. You go into the house. I'll go find this wagon. I'm gonna go in this house quietly. I'm better. I'm better. It's, it's 
nighttime, so that's why I'm doing it, and it's better. Alright, robbed the house. It's worth forty-five dollars. Item song. That fat ass blunt. Is it a blunt? Oh, it's a carrot. I thought it was a blunt. <laughs> See around the house. Oh, shit, a hundred and fifty dollars I found in this house. Hold up. Damn, my, my, my shit thick, man. Oh wait. Get on, dear boy. I'm gonna uh, get on. It's good that we robbed them at night because one, it's less these less people coming at our necks. Less conflict. and it's a good night's work. So what were you able to lift from the house? Found some money stashed away. Must be a few hundred, not too bad. Not bad at all. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly. Damn. So I searched Don't under I won't freaking... I'm looking forward to your retelling. I call this... Near that thing. I would made 150 just for robbing that John. How long you think we're gonna stick around here for? Not sure. You're gonna stick around here until we keep robbing. Slowly but surely. Just need to keep at it. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp, but it's a long way from being full. Telling me how he also makes <sighs> these little trinkets for people from animal claws, teeth, and the such like. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. All right. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. <clears throat> Park that thing in here. Quickly. All right. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Mm -hmm. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. Bet. You're giving discreet, me more money. You know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Uh, nah, I'm good. Uh, I'll catch up with you later. Okay. Stay All out right. of trouble. Damn, seven hundred dollars, fifty f seven fifty four dollars and sixteen cents, man. I'm I'm good. I, I'm I'm telling you, I am not spending nothing else. Well, guys, I'm afraid to let y'all go. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all later. You know, if y'all want to see more, just hit me up with a thumbs up. You know, just with one. I just want only one yeah. like on this video. I'm telling you, it's pretty well. I like it. Seven hundred dollars in one video I made in this game. I mean, seven hundred. <laughs> proud of myself. <laughs> I grow up so fast. <laughs> well, I'm out. <laughs> What's going on, YouTube? This is your boy, Crazy Xbox Player, A.K.A. Jake Larry. And we are back with another video of Red Dead Redemption 2. And this is part 5 we're going to be doing. But 
who the fuck trying to come and start problems with me? I say, I know that plant ain't starting. I'm about to say, cause I'm about to raise hell up and oh my god, what the hell is this? Oh, a snake. Fuck that snake. All right, I gotta head back to the camp because I robbed a couple people. That's just like, oof, you know what I mean, because, all right, now, I'm going to head to John Marston right now, so, um, uh, we're going to sit here and rob a train, pop. or Dead Redemption too. Yep. oof, 